actually recording. Hello everyone and welcome back to another Taz PA video. So today we're gonna be doing another Loot Crate unboxing. Ta da! Brought to you by our friends over at Loot Crate. Check them out. Uh, I don't actually have a um, partnership with them. I wish I did. Um, and I wish I totally had a partnership with them because I totally, totally do it. Um, and I've done one, two, three, four, five, six now crates that I'm doing the month of. Now, Red went ahead and cut it open for me. He also peeked inside. Thank you, Red. Okay, so let's see what's inside this bad boy. The theme was investigate. So, let's open it this way. Oh, cool. So you have to create... It's a little science kit thing. Okay, so the products were... Um, not products. The brands were Batman, Jessica Jones, X-Files, and something else. That I don't remember what. So let's take a look inside this crate, shall we? First thing first, the shirt. Alright. What is this? You guys, I can see it the same time you do, and I don't know what that is. It looks like Undertale. Oh, Stranger Things! That's what the theme was, was Stranger Things. Stranger Things, X-Files, Batman, Jessica Jones. So, shirt must go on. So, give me just a second. There you go. There's your shirt. Oh, and here's my new flash belt. Really cool. Anyway, here's the shirt. Actually, it looks a whole... It looks more like it should be, um... Undertale because of this flower. Um, but it, it looks interesting. I've never actually seen Stranger Things. And you probably couldn't hear me, but if you couldn't hear me, here's what I said. Shirt's pretty cool. Never actually seen Stranger Things. Might check it out now that this shirt, which kind of looks like Undertale because it's a flowery. Might check it out. All right, so next item in the box is an exclusive, I think. Jessica Jones doesn't say Loot Crate exclusive. But I'm pretty sure it's going to be a Loot Crate, it's a Loot Crate exclusive. Is that a pencil shirt? Okay, anyway. Uh, Loot Crate exclusive, I'm pretty sure, Jessica Jones Q-Fig. Now, I know Loot Crate's done Q-Figs before, and I think I have one. I think I have the Doctor Strange Q-Fig. So the Q-Figs are always pretty neat. So let's see what this Jessica Jones Q-Fig is doing. Alright. So she is punching, or kicking down a brick wall. Don't have the best lighting, but see, she's kicking down and breaking down a brick wall. Don't know why she's kicking over this defenseless brick wall, but I have to admit, it's pretty cool. And it's definitely going up on my shelf, which hopefully if I can clear this room out and maybe adjust an office, just a recording studio, I put my, my camera, my desk over there in a the corner. A point over at this corner, and that's where my stuff's at. But I will have to find a spot for Jessica Jones. Alright, so let's see. That is the Jessica Jones, and of course I'm keeping the box. Now you might be going, Taz, why are you keeping the box? Well, here's why. Okay, so I'm keeping the box mainly because if you, if you keep the box and the plastic... When you go to pack it, if you remove, you can just take the figure, put it back in the plastic and in the box, and then take the box the way it is when you got it and put and pack them in securely in the box rather than having to wrap them in toilet paper, in newspaper and such to move. I think it's a lot smarter. All right, so for the Batman, we have color changing mug. Oh, my family's got a Doctor Who version of this. 
where um well sort of we were, when it's hot the tartar is on when it's cold the tartar is on one side then when you add the hot coffee it disappears from that side but it goes on the other. So let's see what this Batman coffee mug. Or just hot chocolate mug. If you like hot chocolate like I do. Uh oh. No 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 no. No. I don't, I don't know, know if it broke in transit, or a red actually broke it when he opened it? But, um... I'm gonna, gonna have, have to contact, contact Loot Crate. Cause look at my mug! How am I supposed to use this? I'm sure this was a great mug, but it's all broken. Barry Allen, you messed with the time force, with the fabric of time way too many times, Barry. You broke my cup. You broke my mug. And look, there's no fixing it. You broke it. Barry Allen. I'm just gonna set that there. So it's back in its packaging. And I'm going to get to the bottom of this. Because that is way too broke to be broken by just by Red opening the box and looking at the stuff. Besides, I will, I will ask Red, and if it's not Red who accidentally broke it when he looked at the stuff, then it means it was broken in shipping. Which means that technically it's not Blue Crate's fault. But I'm going to ask Luke Craig if they will replace it, seeing as how I'm supposed to be getting a full mug. And we'll be taking pictures of it and going, hey, I got proof it's broken. And I'll even have this video because my first time opening it, and I don't think Red opened this box. So... that's I'm contacting Luke Craig and seeing if I can get a replacement. Next we have, ah, oh, cool, a little patch. Okay, so last month during the primal theme, there was the, of course, you know, two months ago during the um, build theme, there was the secret order of the keys. And if you answered those correct questions correctly, you got a pin apparently. I didn't answer the questions in time, so I didn't get a pin. But for the primal, which was last month's, you get a patch with the primal key on it. That says Secret Order of the Keys. Really cool. Really neat. Definitely, if I had a jacket, I'd... Uh, something that I could put, patch, I put patches on, I'd definitely put it on there. Alright, so we've got... A Loot Crate audio recorder. <laughs> like an old... Da, 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 da. Like, like in uh, Fairy Out Parents, it was. I'm Team Tuner and I cheated on my math test. Or I'm Team Tuner and I cheated on my math test. And then we've got X Files pencils. The truth is out there. I want to believe. Trust no one. That's why I put the I in FBI. They put the I in FBI. The X Files pencil set complete with pencil sharpener. All right. And, of course, an investigate book. I'll be right back. 